risk management and psychology very important part of trading you know some people say anecdotally that trading is 20% ability 80% psychology I'm not sure necessarily about those um, those statistics but certainly it is a large part of it for me it's really about the more confident we are the more relaxed we are with the trades that we place the better a trader we tend to be so really this section is very much about trying to reduce those emotions of trading as much as we can. Give ourselves the best chance of making money. So, in other words, trying to trade size the right way. Stops targets in the right places and so on. Making sure we're not risking too much money for us. Making sure we're prepared to lose money as well. It's all part of trading. And also, making sure that we look back at our trades as well there. Don't be seduced into thinking that that which does not make a profit is without value. Effectively, what Arthur Miller is saying there is that have a look back through your trades. You may have made a few mistakes. Identify what those mistakes are. Don't do them again. Learn from previous trades. And that's something that we're going to go through uh, a little bit uh, over this section, which is risk management and psychology.